Hello there everybody. I'm doing a wee video tonight on my one of my old light lights and it's a very large powerful light so I'm just showing you this is where I'm going to be taking the photos then the photos off the light later on and it's just to let you see where I am. Those trees that you can see far up there are about 300 yards. This is a railway line down at the very bottom of the steep dip here. We're at the very top. Goes down the dip across and then up a slope bank to the other side. So it's foreshortened an awful lot. But believe me, that's about 300 yards up there. And then across the way, the next tree down, we're obviously heading down, that's 250, say. But across the way, over this side, you'll see where these lights are. Well, down below, this is the bottom. This is the bottom. It goes down to the railway track. So I'll be shining the light down there and you'll see the differences. This tree here just outside my apartment and down there across and I would say that's about 200 yards. So it's just to give you a rough idea of where I'm shining the light when it's dark. See you then. Bye. Now, hello there. It's me back again. And as I told you just before this, I'm doing a, a video tonight on this Olight R50 Seeker which is by far the biggest flashlight I've ever had. It's one I thought I would never get the chance to even show off. Or I, did, I wasn't even sure if I would want one this big until you actually get one. And then the, the, it's just limitless for when you could use this light. And I, can I just say before I start tonight, I want to say a big... Just a prayer from us over here in Northern Ireland, those in America and those over in the the Philippines that are having a really rough time at the moment, that how sorry we are and we hope they all come through it as unscathed as they, as they possibly can. And it's a, this is a, a perfect, it's a terrible thing to use, but it's the perfect use for something like this. This light is a, Can you see the time in here? I've left it out and I'm not going to add much to it now because this light runs for 50 hours, right? You have 2,500 lumens maximum, but it'll run for 50 hours on one charge, which is USB, which they give you 50 lumens for 50 hours. Now that is just phenomenal. That is a huge, huge um, time scale to keep that amount of torch on. I just find that mind blowing. You get a quality five year warranty promise. So if it stops working because of a fault of the torch itself, you just give it back to them and you get another one or they fix it. I mean, it's just unbelievable now this is by no means cheap and to get something that's going to run for 50 hours you wouldn't expect it to be cheap because you're not going to get the quality that goes with Olight. Olight are a world leader in flashlights torch whichever you want to call it we call it a torch over here uh, in the uk so it's 2500 lumens really really bad you can use it as a searchlight for a short period of time it doesn't last forever it lasts it, you know it goes for a few minutes then it steps down and i'll show you that later on but it'll throw a flood for 297 meters i would just say 300 yards and what i'm going to show you tonight is at least 300 yards away from where we're sitting now and i'm going to show you just the sort of light you're, you're going to get. And bearing in mind, I'm in a lit building, an apartment block that is shining light towards where I'm going to shine this light. Just to let you see how powerful it is. I hope that's going to turn out okay. So, it comes in this box. And, yeah, isn't that scary? That's how small it is. That's how small it is for that torch. It is... Five, it's not even five and a half inches, just over five and a quarter. At the base here is your USB, it's waterproof, you just pull that off, stick your USB charger, which they give you, into it, push it back in again. Run on a side button here, lovely blue tint round the aluminium, it's alumin aircraft grade aluminium. And it's oh, Cree XHP 50. I'm just going to leave that sitting there for a wee minute. I can take this box out of the way. I don't really need the box. So what's the other features on it? I said it's got the Cree. It's XHP 50. 
It's a maximum output of 2,500 lumens and a beam distance of 300 yards. Side switch, which I said, goes through all the cycles, low, medium, high. And on turbo, obviously, it's a 2,500. Then it steps down to 800. Then it go down then from high to medium, which is 300, and low, which is 50. And then it goes for 50 hours on low. I, I just That blows my head. It's um, waterproof. It's the IX8 waterproof. One meter drop. Uh, shouldn't do it any damage. I'm not going to try them things. People have done that on the TV for years and shown how they can drop them. I remember through night of this terrible thing. This can do all that. I'm just not going to do it. It's the most beautiful lamp and it's too expensive to start throwing about the concrete. There's no way I would do it. And, I, you know, when you think of them poor people out there over in, in America and in the Philippines, to have 50 hours of light on you, when something like that's happening to them, you know, that's two days of light. And if you don't use it all the time, well, obviously you're not going to use it at night time or the daytime. But, you know, if you ration it, just think how long that can last. And if you have a power bank in the house, just think how long you can have light that's both powerful and consistent and keep you safe and keep your family safe. Perfect. But for me, this is more for servicemen, a policeman, a security guard. Somebody that's got to do rounds of building sites. Somebody that's got to go out and do rounds of apartment blocks. Any sort of security work, this is absolutely put. It's fist filling. That's all it is. There's my hand. It's fist filling. It is just um, the most perfect size of a light. Now, there... It's quite simply my 940. That's the size of it. There's the big PM2 in the same colours as it. And it's just about the same length as a PM2. So that gives you, if you can get that much power and that much, it's a rechargeable battery, which comes with it. Which comes with it. I mean, this is, you don't have to buy anything. This comes with it. It also comes with a charger and a plug of your country, whichever you, you use. And it's just an ordinary USB plug. You can use your telephone plugs or whatever for it if you need to. So the price, which is going to be hard for some people to swallow because a lot of my stuff would be budget. This is not budget. This is Olight. And I've said it from the beginning. We were very lucky for Olight to come on board. This, at the moment I looked today, was about £118, I think it was. £118. But I get 15% off anything that they've got, as long as it's not on sale. So, as that stands, that would work out at about £100. So, you'll get that sort of £18 off. That's a big lump of money off, a light. And I know £100 sounds dear, but if you think of your family, if you think of your family in a disaster or something happens that you need to have that, whether you're um, camping alone or you're doing whatever, this is something that can be invaluable. I, I'm one of these believers. Torches are, everybody laughs, oh, I don't need a torch until you actually need one. And then there is no substitute. There is no substitute in darkness than a torch. Your lighter and a wee candle will only last you so long. So... I think it's perfect. I'm not going to rabbit on about it. It is dear. I know it's dear. And, you know, this is for people in the UK uh, and uh, the Republic of Ireland. Look, you get 15% off. It brings it down to 100. This is a treat. There's no doubt about it. But just for the size of it, there's a PM2. Do you know what I mean? There's a PM2 lying on top of it. So it's hardly thicker than a PM2. And you're getting that sort of illumination. I just, I can't recommend it highly enough, but it's all light. You know, you know that's it. it. It is all light. It's you know, like all my other lights that are all light at the minute. I've changed all my lights to all light. And yes, a lot of that's to do with what was given to me, but my other lights were given to me as well, but they're not as good as the all light. They're just not as good. And they don't give a five-year warranty. That is just amazing. So, I leave you with this. I'm now going to turn you off a second. Wait till it goes pitch black. And then I'm going to show you this beam 
across the other side of the railway lines do you see the difference that a good flashlight can do but you remember on 50 this lasts for 50 hours with 50 lumens and if you remember nothing else about this torch tonight remember that and think how useful that could be you know god bless those people in california but but on the west coast of america no it's not the west coast the east coast and um, that if they didn't have light how much this would help them so our prayers go to them and I'm going to show you the light out the window and then that's the video over. Thank you so much for watching. If you need any more information, please ask me down below and I'll give you the information you need. It's about, I meant to say the, the weight of it is about 9 ounces, which is, I think it's 255 uh, grams. So it's about 9 ounces. That's pretty light for what you get and that's including the battery. So take care. Bye bye. Hello, that's us back again. This is me. I'm on the second floor and I'm shining down. That's the tree I was talking about. And I'm going to point over here. If I, you can follow that. Now, you can't. This is terrible. It's not getting a great view of where. Let me get up this way and see where we're going. Right. Look, can you see that? Look at them trees up there. If I take that away, can you see it? That's 300 yards away. How good is that? Can you, can you see the light itself shining? Down there are the, the lights from the other apartments uh, blocking it off. But look at that. Away. Up. I don't want to get the police coming. <laughs> but isn't that just amazing? 300 yards with a light. And you can see, I mean, I can see the, I could see a bird sitting in that tree. That's how clear that is. I could see a bird sitting on it. There we are. Away and up. Look at that, 300 yards. And even the trees behind it, I can see. There's the one in front of it that I was telling you about, about 250 yards, 300 yards. Unbelievable. So, I mean, yes, I can go ahead and show you lots of others, but this is a hedge in front of me. This is only sort of 30, 40 feet, but look at that tree in front. I mean, you can actually see birds' nests. You can see the birds themselves, for goodness sake. And this is, there's flower pots and all down below. And there's lights on out there. That's why I find it so amazing. So I'm going to turn that off, folks. It is unbelievable. And there's probably better shots of it in other videos. But that's mine. I thoroughly recommend it. A great light. Take care. Bye-bye. Paddy's away for a cup of coffee.